Hi, it's Beanie. Look at this, how many hearts I made. This one is organic cotton. This one's cotton. These ones are made out of wool. This is cotton. And I use different crochet hooks. The bigger the crochet hook, the bigger the heart. I use the F of five for the small heart. Isn't it cute? This one too. And then I use the K ten and a half for the bigger ones. And then I used a H8, a 5 millimeter for this size hearts. Let me show you. You can just use any yarn you have. I had these. First we start with a slip knot. Like we said, we leave a little string. Depends how long you want it. For whatever you want to use it for. We're making a slip knot. That's how I learned how to make a slip knot when I was in Germany. A knot. Then we chain four. One, two, three, four. And then we put four, I mean three, treble crochets into the first stitch right here. The very first one. Go through two, through two, and another two. Now we're going to make a second treble into that same first stitch. You put the yarn over twice like we did and go through two, through two and another two. We're going to make three treble into the first chain. Now we're going to make three double crochet also in that same first chain. With the double crochet you put the yarn over the hook one time. You go through two and through another two. We're going to make three And that's how it's supposed to look like. Look at this, isn't that pretty? It's almost a half a heart. Now I'm going to chain one and then make another treble. With the treble, again, you put yarn over twice over the um, crochet hook, stitch into the very first chain like all the others. You go through two, two, and two. And then we make another chain. And look at this. Uh, this. Uh, this is half a heart. Now we are going to do the other half of the heart. Remember, these are treble stitches and then we made double crochet. And you'll be making double crochet on this side and then treble stitches. We're going to make three double 
crochet in that same first stitch and I wanted to show you I am keeping this uh, thread here where I started I'm keeping it towards this side I am not trying to uh, crochet this in in here with the stitches. I'm keeping it like this because I figured out that's the best way to do it for if you want to tie it together later on with the other string. Okay, now we're going to make two more double crochet. We made one. Okay. Three double crochet. Now we need three more treble stitches. Some people say triple. Put yarn over twice like we did before, and we go still into that same first chain. Where we put all of the stitches into. One more treble stitch. So we have three treble stitches all together after the double crochet. And let me show you. Now we're going to make four chains to finish it. One, two, three. Then we're going to make a slip stitch into that same hole. Let me show you. And with a, a slip stitch, you do not take uh, put yarn over. You just stitch in right into that same hole where we put all those stitches and I'm just leaving that thread so I can tie it later a slip stitch is you pull it right through there we go so this is the string we started with and uh, I wanted it about this long, five or six inches, and so we're just going to cut it. Got my beautiful scissors. All we have to do is pull this through. When you see, and make both of them tied. Now I'm going to tie the strings together. And I'm going to make another knot. Look at this. It looks pretty, doesn't it? What we're going to do is tie it. And just tie it on the top. Isn't this pretty? Look at that. Now you can be proud of yourself and make a couple of special gifts for Valentine's Day. See how we tied it? Pretty neat, huh? Till next time and happy Valentine's Day. Love, Beanie.